What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald Walkthrough. Okay, so, before we go into our fifth battle, our fifth gym battle right here, I forgot to uh, showcase something to you guys, and that was the battle tent in uh, Verdant Turf Town. Like see, yes, Verdant Turf site, yes, feast your eyes on these battles. Now, this place right here is a little unique tent because, well... The battles are based off the Pokemon's natures, and <laughs> you guys got to see it for yourself. This whole episode is just a big ol' you-know-what show right here. So, let's see. Here is the trainer's trust towards the Pokemon it is tested. Let's go right ahead and take a look at the info. So, in Verdure Battle Tent, there is one crucial rule that must be ob obeyed. Trainers are permitted only to switch their Pokemon in and out. Trainers are otherwise forbidden to command their Pokemon. The Pokemon are to behave accordingly to their nature of battle in their own. You must put your trust in your Pokemon and watch over them. If you if you achieve the honor of beating three trainers in succession, we will present you with a prize. If you want uh, to interrupt your challenge, please save your game. Da 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 and whatever. So we're gonna be doing the challenge right here, guys. I don't necessarily think we're gonna be winning this whole thing. I tried it out off screen, nearly won the darn thing on our, off our first try, but everything is based off our, our uh, what was it called, our nature right here, so, oh man, okay, so I'm gonna go with Vesuvius, Sage, and quite possibly, let's go with a Dukin right here, and yeah, we're just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna show this to you guys, uh, I might fast forward to where we win to show you guys what kind of gift we have, but right here, this is strictly based off the, the the nature of the Pokemon right here. What I do next is all up to them. I want the World Movie Collection. Okay. Oh my god. And, well, here we are taking on school kid Nala. She will be coming out with her Wingle. Oh crap, baskets. And, well, we're just gonna pick, pick fight. And off the natures of these Pokemon, they're gonna, you know, they're gonna pick what kind of uh, moves they want to get. And obviously, my guy is picking, yeah, it's picking a uh, Focus Energy right there. Holy crud baskets! And here we go again. And oh my God, we're gonna get our butt. What? Are you serious, man? Come on! And the glint appears in Vesuvius's eye. Oh my God, we're gonna get beat. And just like that, Vesuvius, you. Oh my God. Okay, so let's go with Hadouken. Oh my god. Alright, let's see what happens here. So, here comes a Twister attack. Obviously, this is a Dragon-type move. That messes up. And, well, we flinch. Holy crud. Okay, so... <laughs> it turns out that my, my Pokemon's natures are ridiculous. Come on, man. Pick something! Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh my god, we're getting our butts kicked. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys suck. Oh, what is a glit? Okay. Seriously, Hadouken? Oh my god, okay, so that. This is not. This is shaping up to be the worst. The worst of the battle tents that we're going up against, and of course, we are capable of using our, its power. What, what, what's going on here? How is this Wingle kicking our butts? Oh my god. One little friggin' Wingle is getting our butts, and look at that. Okay, one hit KO. Okay, Sage. Well, at least we're not getting swept by this chicken. She's gonna come out with a zigzag goon. This looks like. Seriously, man? Oh, great. Oh, man. We're gonna we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, if we win this out of some miracle, it's going to be because of Sage. And that was a critical hit again. Here comes another Mud Sport. So this Zigzagoon. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord in heaven. Okay, so as you guys can tell, berries are very crucial to healing up your Pokemon. You can't heal them by yourselves. You can't ask them for any kind of help. And, well, okay, seriously, bro, attack. Oh, great biscuits. Okay, Pin Missile would have destroyed us, so... Incapable of using its power. What, 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 what's going on here? Oh, buckets. 
Yeah, we're gonna get our butts kicked by meager-ass Pokemon. Oh my god. Super effective. Getting into the... What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. Well... Yeah. Look at that, guys. We are one and done. What the hell? And it stole our experience share. What the heck? Uh, you better give us back that experience share. Don't like very... Okay, yeah. So, as you can see, yeah, having you seen your Pokemon's exploit, yeah, no. Okay, so... Let's see. I'm gonna go off screen. I'm gonna go to the part where we actually win this, okay? Because you guys already know me, I am very competitive, so I'll be right back with you guys. Oh my god, it took us three tries and it finally did it. Oh my god, so here it is, guys. We won our third battle. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, to achieve a three win streak, the bonds that you bind your part with your Pokemon seem firm and true. Your feet will be recorded. I must ask you briefly to wait. And yes, we won. And we get ourselves a nest ball. Seriously, a nest ball? When you, ha when you have forfeited your heart and your Pokemon, you must return. Okay. Uh, yeah. So that's what happens when you win the this battle right here. It was a... Uh, <laughs> oh god. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm not even gonna read that, but that's what happens, guys. Holy buckets. Oh my god. Yeah. Like, again, I'm gonna walk straight to, to Petalburg and I'm gonna be talking. Actually, you know what? Let's go get some repels. That way we don't get attacked by any of these Pokemon. So, I was talking about uh, this in the last few episodes, guys. Um about the Battle Frontier. Many of you guys have been asking for it, and I, I've been playing around with the idea. I really have, and... <laughs> oh, shoot. I've been looking up the, these, these things right here. These are exactly what's probably gonna happen at the Battle Frontier. It's god dang annoying. It's very, very annoying, guys. And, you know, having to go through these battles, I... <sighs> Especially having to go through, going through them like a hundred times in a row, seventy times in a row. It doesn't really matter how many times in a row. It, it's, it, it's like you know. Okay, now I'm starting to see why back in uh, 2010, 2011, I cheated to, to win these whole things because it's ridiculous. Just going off the natures alone, going off the natures alone, it, it's like okay. So how in the hell are we gonna win ten times in a row with with this? I don't know, guys, but. Ugh, oh, jeebus. Anywho. Yes, I'm still thinking of doing the Battle Frontier. Don't worry, guys. I'm not quitting on you. Oh, my God. It's ridiculous. It really is. It's ridiculous, guys. Oh God. Anywho. So, we're going all the way back to Petalburg because, well, we has to. We have to take on our dad and all that stuff. And that's always going to be... That's always going to be something right there. Oh, my God. What am I getting into? Seriously. I don't know. So, this has been our episode. Yes, I know it's a short one, but we're back in the Petalburg City, and, uh, well... The next episode will be interesting because we, have, we will be taking on our dad, and this gym in particular is very strategic when it comes to maneuvering it, and I think we're going to be battling every single one of these trainers, so there will be some speeding involved. Yeah, I know. Anywho, guys, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for uh, staying patient, as always. In the next episode, we will be taking on our father right here in the Pokemon uh, Gym. See you guys.